So, this is how to put the roof down on an MG Midget. The first thing you have to do is to undo poppers, starting with the interior poppers. On my particular car, it prefers uh, you to undo the driver's side exterior poppers first. You can see they're rather stiff. But not quite as stiff as the passenger side poppers. Now we can undo the clips that hold the front bar of the roof to the windscreen, which allows us to fold the mechanism back. We take the fabric from the mechanism fold the mechanism into its place. Unfortunately where the uh, seat belts have been mounted means my roof bar does not quite go all of the way into the car. We can now fold the roof fabric into its correct location, taking care not to put any creases into the transparent part of the roof, because this can cause cracking. Now we can put the protective cover over the roof and mechanism. Yes, there's a lot more poppers. It's definitely something I don't miss about old cars. This part just stops the uh, roof fabric from blowing about in the wind. It also makes the look of the car much more clean. Because the uh, roof mechanism doesn't quite fold on the way into my car, it's very hard to do the interior poppers up. I plan to fix this by uh, bringing the poppers mounted to the car close to the roof mechanism by putting some washers behind them. And now it's just finishing with the last row of poppers on the back of the car. I'm trying to get that interior one done but uh, it's very unlikely that it will stay. And I should have been thought a bit better about what I was wearing. <laughs> and that's the last pupper. And there we go. So, as you might have guessed, this is a bit of an advert for a new series that I've got coming up soon. Here is the trailer for it. Subscribe to the channel and it will be coming out soon. See you in the next one.